This YouTube channel has broke the YouTube algorithm right now. It has only uploaded 11 videos and gained almost 400,000 subscribers, which is crazy considering the quality of content they produce. Their video consists basically of some crappy monkey that explains economic stuff in a simple and funny way. And let me tell you why this strategy is so brilliant. Their videos are very easy to create, and the best part is their RPM. RPM means revenue per milli. In simple terms, that's how much YouTube will pay you per 1,000 views. And it all depends on the niche or style of your content. Let's say in some health and fitness niche, you can get something around $5 to $15 per 1,000 views. But the economic niche is on a whole nother level because they can get as high as $50, potentially even more than that. Social Blade says they are making up to $18,000 a month, which is totally crazy considering they uploaded only 11 videos. Or take this channel, for example. They uploaded their first video not even two months ago and already gained 200,000 subscribers with only 24 videos. So it's safe to say they are onto something here. And lucky for you, in today's video, I'll show you exactly how you can create similar videos like them. I'll show you how to come up with unlimited amount of video topics, creating viral and engaging scripts, creating your own unique characters, and how to easily edit it all together. And trust me, you won't need any prior experience for this. All you need is to follow all the steps shown in this video. But before you get too excited, there is one thing you need to know. In order to get paid from this videos, your channel needs to meet YouTube monetization requirements, which are 1,000 followers and 4,000 watch hours, which is a hard thing to do because on average, it can take up to six months to get your channel monetized. That means you won't make a single dollar until then. Luckily for you, there's a way around it since you can now buy pre-monetized YouTube accounts on this website. This means that the previous owner has already achieved the monetization requirements, so you can make money on your very first post. And it's good to mention they offer a full account warranty. So if anything happens with your account, they will replace it with a new one. And yes, it's expensive, but the truth is you can make that much with your first video. So if you are serious about this, I link the website in the video description, and if you use the code GROWWITHAI, you will get $20 off. Anyway, to start off, the first thing we need is to come up with the video topics. If you have your own topic that you would like to cover, that's great, and go for it. But for many of you that have absolutely no idea what to do, just open up ChatGPT and paste in this prompt that I have made earlier for you guys. You can get all the prompts used in this video inside my free community, open free resources section, and look for a link named Monkey Prompts and grab it. It's free and saves you a lot of time. So, once you have your prompt ready, you can change this number here to get as many video topics as you want. You can literally ask for 100 video topics and ChatGPT will generate all 100 topics for you. But for this video, I'll go with 20. After ChatGPT has generated the video topics, what you want to do is pick one and then we can move on to creating the video about that topic. And after you are done with the first video, you can pick another topic and so on. But now, paste in the second prompt. This prompt will basically generate the whole video script for you. Here, replace this topic with your video topic that you have picked. And then, if you need, you can adjust the word count based on how long you want your video to be. For this tutorial, I'll go for 200 words and that will give me a video that will be about one minute long. But you can go with whatever length you want. Now, just hit generate. And as you can see, we have our viral script ready. And it's exactly what we needed. It uses the phrases like monkey happy, monkey sad, which is exactly what these big channels use as well. So now with the viral script ready, it's time to generate the AI voiceover. Don't worry, you won't need to record yourself or hire someone to do that. Instead, we will use a website called Eleven Labs, which is hands down the best AI software for voiceover. So head over to Eleven Labs and here you have two options. Either you go through hundreds of voices and find one you like, or use the one I'm using, which is perfect for these style of videos. And to find it up here, select default voices and then look for a voice called Liam. Once you have found it, click on this icon to use it. Here you want to paste the script, but before you generate it, make sure you generate the script in sections, because if you generate the whole script at once, it will sound robotic and unnatural, and we don't want that. Instead, copy the script in sections. That way you ensure the voiceover has the best quality possible. Now just hit generate, and then just repeat this process for the whole script. So I'll speed this part up slightly and get back to you when I'm done. All right, now we have the voiceover ready, we can move on to the harder part of this video, so pay attention now. As you can see, they use these crappy hand-drawn images, and that's about it. And it works because it's unique, and no one else uses this in the finance niche. And since I'm not an artist, I will show you how to use AI to generate something similar. 
So basically we will use the text prompts I have made earlier just for you guys and use those prompts in a text to image software to bring those prompts to life. And then we will take those images and customize them to make your own unique characters inside Canva. This step will be important since it will set you apart from hundreds of others trying to do the same. So to start off, you want to head over to a website called Leonardo AI and sign up. They will give you 150 credits each day for free. Here, click on this button that says image. Now paste in this prompt that you will find in the document. Obviously, you can change this prompt to fit your video style. So let's say you can change the monkey to some other animal or change the styling of the monkey. Then on the left, you need to change the settings. So click on preset and choose the GPT image one model. Next, change the image dimensions to one to one and set the amount of images to one. Now just hit generate. And after a few seconds, Leonardo has generated this. I mean, it is what we need, so I think it's good. But if you don't like it, generate the prompt a few more times. And when you are happy with the results, copy the second prompt and generate it. Now you get the point. Just repeat the same process for all the prompts from the document. It will take some time, so I'll get back to you when I'm done. All right, we've got all the images we need. Now just download all of them by clicking on this button. And with the images downloaded, we can move on to the last and most important thing before editing, and that is to customize our characters. And to do that, head over to Canva, and on the home page, click on Create, and select Custom Size Option. And here type 1920 by 1080. Now upload the first monkey from Leonardo. What you want to do here is to scale it up a little bit and put it in the middle of the screen. Then up here, click on edit and find a background remover. This will basically remove everything behind the monkey. You will see why we did that when we get to the editing. Now download this monkey by clicking on share, then download and here switch the file type to PNG. Next, select the transparent background option and hit download. Now if you paid attention to the examples I showed you earlier, they use different styled monkeys or characters so you want to do the same. On the left, click on tools and select the draw option. Choose the color you want and then simply draw something like a farmer's hat. Basically what you want to do is to make a custom character for different scenes of your videos. Some examples might be glasses, hats, suits, etc. So take your time and be creative here because this will make your channel unique and recognizable by the people in the future. And I know this might seem stupid, but as I showed you, it really works. Anyway, now I will just remove the backgrounds on the other photos, make some adjustments, and download all of them. Okay. Now I have everything downloaded and ready, we can move on editing. And don't worry if you never edited a video before, we will do it in CapCut, which is the easiest editing software there is. And if you follow everything I do, you will have all the knowledge you need to create these videos. So, open CapCut and import all of the images and voiceover. Start off by dragging the voiceover onto the timeline. And as you can see, there are these pauses here. Sometimes AI voices do this. So you want to remove them so that the voiceover is smooth and professional. And to do that, on the left, select the split tool and make cuts like this every time there is a silent moment. Now, select the silent moments, one by one, and delete them. When you are done with that, simply drag the voiceovers together like this. All right, the first step is done, and it wasn't that hard. Now, we need to add a simple white background. And to do that, up here, click on library and drag this white background above the voiceover. Then, on the right, lower the speed so that the background covers more of the voiceover. Now, just copy it and crop it in the end. Okay, with this done, we are now ready for the final part. But this part is the most important of them all, since we are going to create the all-important scenes. And what you want to do is basically build these scenes based on what is said in the voiceover. For example, here my video starts like this. In the jungle market, monkeys traded leaves for bananas. Life was good. One banana equals one leaf. Monkey happy. So what I'll do is basically put the market stand in the scene, then place a farmer monkey behind it with some bananas on the table, representing that they sell bananas. Then add a sign that says one leaf equals one banana, and add a happy monkey on the side. And that's it! Basically, what you want to do is craft the scenes like this for the whole voiceover. I'll show you the video at the end so you have some reference, but for now, I'll speed up this process and get back to you when I am done with all of the scenes. All right, as you can see, I have finished all the scenes, and this is how mine and your timeline should look like. Now, all that's left to do is export the video. So, click on Export and set the resolution to 1080p and frame rate to 60 to ensure the best quality possible. 
you have just learned how to create an unlimited amount of video topics along with viral scripts that are proven to go viral. Now you know how to use AI to generate voiceover and images for you in literally a few minutes. And then I showed you how to edit everything together like all those viral channels do. But before I show you the final result, if you find this video helpful, please leave a comment. Showing me your support, it helps me more than you think and allows me to research more of this under the radar stuff for you guys. And if you want to take this seriously, I recommend you check out Monetize Profiles. I'll leave a link in the description. And if you want any help on your journey, join my free community where I help almost 2,000 people every single day. Now here is the final result. Once upon a time in the jungle market, monkeys traded leaves for bananas. Life was good. One banana equals one leaf. Monkey happy. But then, oh no, a drought hits. Fewer bananas grow. Banana farmers cry. Supply go down. Monkeys still hungry. They want bananas now, but there aren't enough for all. So the price? Banana go up. Now it's two leaves for one banana. Monkey sad. Then, next season, banana boom. Farms overflow with bananas, bananas everywhere, even in monkey shoes, supply go up, but monkeys already full, demand, meh, so banana go down, one banana now costs half a leaf, monkey happy again, then one genius monkey, Chad yells, wait, if we all want more bananas, price go up, if we chill, price go down, monkeys nod wisely, Chad becomes banana economist. Supply is how many bananas exist. Demand is how much monkeys want them. When demand goes bananas, but supply is low, banana expensive. When supply is bananas, but monkeys chill, banana cheap. In conclusion, more bananas plus less monkey. Hype equals happy leaf wallets. So next time banana go up, remember, it's just supply and demand, monkey. Thanks for watching. Smash that banana-shaped subscribe button for more jungle economics.